Hi everyone, uh, Redbeard here. Um, <clears throat> I wanted to start this video. Well, I've been wanted to do this for a while. Um, I wanted to apologize, uh, and the the reason I want to apologize is that I haven't been making content. I've been struggling a lot with uh, just kind of everything recently. I haven't even sat down in front of this computer in like three weeks to do anything and I'm just having a really hard time you know there's not like there's not like a, like anything going on you know in my personal life that's making me do this I just I'm having a hard time sitting down and just wanting to do really anything um so I'm dealing with a lot of mental health things in that regards I don't I, I don't want this to come off like I, I'm, as, I'm looking for pity or anything like that by any means but I just feel like I need to at least express myself a little bit here um I just don't want to do anything. Like, and it, and it sucks to say that. Like, a lot of imposter syndrome, a lot of just invasive thoughts. Like I said, I'm, I'm dealing with a whole lot, and I'm just trying to get a grip of myself. And that's the worst part about it, is all I want to do is I want to make more content. I want to do more things. I want to upload, and I haven't been doing that. And, um, I mean, I've... Even on my normal days off, when I would sit down, I'd grind to get some stuff out. I don't want to do anything. I barely even play video games, just regularly. You know, I'm I'm trying to, and I'm trying to get back to just being me. Um, this is kind of how I felt when I shut down Rhino Vision, when I shut down my original channel uh, that I did when I branched off as well. If any of you were there for that, um, you know, I have been struggling with the idea of what I'm trying to do with this channel. And I always tell myself that, you know, I'm just doing this for fun, which is what a lot of content creators do say. They're, I'm doing this for fun. I'm, you know, I'm not I'm not doing this for the cloud. I'm not doing this for views. I'm, you know, which, which was, it's kind of bullshit, you know? Cause like, I mean, I say that to myself, but I mean, of course that's what I want, right? Like I want to blow up. Who doesn't, honestly, like, It'd be silly to think that you actually don't because if you woke up one day and all of a sudden you had, you know, 300,000 subscribers and you did this full time, that's what you want, right? And I know people get burnt out for the people who actually are doing this for a living, but that's just not what I'm saying. Um, what I'm saying is I feel like I'm lying to myself a lot about why I do this and I want to get back to why I started to do YouTube gaming content again, right? Because like, I've said so many times to myself that I don't have a niche. I don't do anything different than anyone else does with YouTube gaming. You know, I'm not a VR specialist. I'm not a horror game specialist. You know, and not even specialist isn't the best word, but it's I don't have one thing. I just turn on a game and I play it. I have fun with it. And I try to make something fun and entertaining for people to the best of my ability. Um, and when I did Rhino Vision, it became more like I was trying to do it as a job. And that's part of the reason I burnt myself out of doing it. And I didn't want to do that with this. I wanted to come on here and just casually play games. So I started Twitch streaming as well, just to kind of be just chill. Like a lot of people do it. And there's so many people out there that do it so much better than me. So for the few people who actually do watch my content, thank you for being here and being around. But it's tough for me because I want to sit here and I want to do like all these different, I have all these different ideas and I want to play all these different games, but I also, I don't want to just play them and then sit and edit them for the next four hours and then lose all of my free time and then miss out on doing other things. You know, like I'm trying to balance when and what I want to do. And I've dealt with that for so long. I mean, I've been making content on and off for nine years on YouTube, that's gone nowhere. And that's, to a point it's okay. You know, like sure, of course I beat myself up about it all the damn time that I'm not doing something right or, uh, wh or what am I doing wrong, you know? But again, it's also part of that, you know, like other content creators who have seen success or even myself, I've told other people to be like, just, you know, do what you like and it will, something will come about it, but that's not always true. And I like to try to be a realist about these types of things, about what I am and who I am. And that's why I don't want to change what I'm doing or how I'm doing it right now. 
but I also don't want to burn out and just grind and grind and grind and go, what am I doing? You know, is my content good enough? Do people like what I do? Do people like my voice? Do people like my face? Do people like this? This is why these things keep coming in. And I know a lot of people deal with this. So I'm not looking to say that what I'm dealing with is what anybody else isn't dealing with. Right. So this is just more of a sense of, I, I guess I don't really know what the sense is to, to be fair. Um, I think about this all the time of what I've done in the past with YouTube creation, with Twitch creation, with going to filmmaking school, with trying to make movies, to writing scripts, to all this. And I think the biggest conclusion I've come to is I used to consider myself a hard worker because of how long I've done things like this. But then on the other hand, I came to the conclusion that I half-ass everything. And I mean that in sincerity, that I do. I half-ass everything. I'm mediocre at best at everything that I do. I'm reaching for that handout as opposed to grinding and grinding like so many other people out there do and do much better than I do. And this isn't to knock myself. I'm not trying to sound like I'm completely coming down on myself for this. It's just for the fact that it's something that I've done, you know, I'll grind and grind and grind and I'll be like, I did great, but then I'll just stop. And then I go, what am I doing wrong? And then I think, and I'm like, is it because I'm not still grinding? Is it because I'm not making good enough stuff? What is it? You know, every, and I, I, I've come to that conclusion that I'm that way in almost everything I do. Right. I'm not good at something. I'm just okay at a lot of things, which I don't think is bad. But it is also why I have such a hard time doing what I want to do because I beat myself up about it a lot where I'm like, what I'm doing isn't good enough. And that's why I haven't done a lot of content since I've come back from Gen Con because like, since I came back, I don't know why. It's just been a constant stream of like, nothing you do is going to be good enough. You're not going to get there. You're not going to get that handout that you so desperately want in your own mind. You're not just going to wake up and have actual 10,000 views and another 10,000 subscribers. And the, tomorrow you're going to be able to not go to your job and you're going to be able to do this like you've wanted to for so long. It's not going to happen. We know success doesn't happen overnight. And I feel like there's points where I have felt like I've deserved it, which is a terrible thing to say, which is a terrible way to put it because I don't. What have I done that has made things so much different or better? Or, you know, what, what do I do for people that makes it seem like I do deserve it? But I have those thoughts. That's why I don't like where my brain is at right now, because I do it all the time. I was even doing it the other day, trying to think of like making a, an actual D&D &D campaign. And I went, well, do I have the time to do that? Am I going to be good enough? I can't prep something like that. And I beat myself down and down. And I know a lot of us do that. Uh, so the point I'm trying to make is, you know, what I really want to do is just be me on this channel and just sit back and do this when I can. And I want to be there in a sense where I feel like I do have a voice that I can express the way I feel more. And I want to do that and more than just coming on here and getting scared at video games or screaming at them because... I have a voice that I want to be able to express the way I feel. And I think that's, like, that's what I've come to the most is that I'm terrified to speak my mind for a lot of things. I do it in my personal life a lot. And I don't feel like I get, I, I don't feel like I'm listened to. And I don't think that's the fault of anybody. It, it, most likely I'm actually being listened to. You know, and I just get in my head of thinking like no one wants to hear what I have to say. So I'm trying to validate myself more to pick myself up and be like, no, people do want to listen to what you have to say. And I love content creation. I want to create more. I want to do so much more. I want to play video games. I want to talk about them. I want to talk about movies and shows and all of this. And a lot of the time, I don't feel like I get to. Whether or not that's actually true or not, again, we know how that type of stuff works, you know, with your own brains. But 
It's how I feel. And that's part of the reason I have not been making things that I've wanted to make. Um, and especially around this time of year is when I get really, I, I start to hurt a lot because the, because of like what happened to my sister um, a long time ago. Uh, and it makes it really tough for me because I just sit back and just don't do anything. So I've been talking for 10 minutes here and, you know, for anybody who actually listened to it, thanks for sticking around. But, you know, again, this wasn't, this wasn't meant to be like, you know, I'm looking for pity or looking for anything of the sort. I just want to express how I feel about what I'm doing, how I'm trying to do things. And I want to be better. And I also want to be better for myself. So if you don't see that much content when it's on my channel, go watch some of my older stuff if you want to, because I'm struggling and I'm trying to do better for myself instead of doing better for others because I need to think of myself a lot of the time too. So um, I'm hoping to uh, create a couple of things here, hopefully in the next couple of weeks that is going to be different. Um, and I hope it works out. So good to talk to you guys again. Thanks for listening. If you did. And uh, I could probably go on and on, but I don't want to bore you. Uh, there I go again. Um, but anyway, guys, I just needed to pop in with this update. This is why content has not been rolling out as much as I wanted to. So have a great rest of your day. We'll see you guys. Bye.